Welcome back, this is Bosco with an episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Now today we're going to be doing things a little bit differently. Uh, I am going to be, well, I am going through the game again for a second time. Uh, right now we're at a point, a very crucial point here. Uh, this determines a lot in the game. When Magus, Luke, but, we, well, I couldn't name him yet, uh, asks if we wish to fight him. This time we are going to fight him. Very well then, but you shall not defeat me easily. Yes, yes I will. Because I don't really even need to try, to be honest with you. This guy is ridiculously easy. I don't even need to, uh, to, to use text. I'm going to because it makes the fight go faster, but I don't need to. I could easily do this. Uh, just attacking the entire time, and I'll be able to finish him off. Let's go ahead and cast uh, Haste on JoJo so that she can go a little bit faster. Uh, now, the way that New Game Plus works is you start the game from the very beginning. However, you keep all your experience. And, yeah, like I said, he's not tough at all. Uh, and you keep all of your items with one exception, and that one exception being the Mass Moon Air, because that is a plot-related item. So you keep all the equipment, all your uh, healing items, all that kind of stuff. That stays with you. Uh, so that makes the rest of this very, very easy, to be honest with you. Uh, I was one-shotting bosses up until, I believe, um, until we got JoJo. You know, I, I just was not having a problem with enemies at all. Press X to win is how this works. Now, if you defeat... Uh, Mage is here. If you defeat Luke, obviously he is not going to join your party. And this affects a lot of what's going to happen later on. You get 3,000 experience points for beating him, 4,000 gold. I don't know how many tech points because it doesn't matter. I don't get tech points anymore. Uh, I don't think it... Uh, I don't think you get any normally for this boss fight, though. Defeat me and you will break the curse on Novin. Yes. Yes, we will. If you want... Bring Vash back, find Gaspar, the guru of time. So, he does still tell us how to get uh, Vash back. This is the point of the game where we have to get his clone back. But, because we have defeated Magus, well, we get the amulet back, and, well, he's gone. Y you can't get him back if you defeat him here, and he will not join your party. But that's okay, he didn't have any dual text or triple text sometimes. Anyway, uh, he did have a few triple texts, but uh, you need the rock in order to get those. So, with that out of the way, we can uh, continue on to the next variation that I'm going to be showing off. For our first variation, we are back in Lean Square doing some of the mini games that we have in here. I didn't feel right doing this one in the main uh, the main series, so I'm going to be doing this all now. Uh, you need, uh, well, okay, Vix is the one in the middle here, first of all. You need to have every single character rotate to the front part, and then, as a result, you get a Poyozo doll for each of them. Now, of course, if I had Luke with me, he could give me a seventh Poyozo doll, but I do have six of them now that I have everybody uh well, everybody represented with a Boyozo doll in Vash's room. Sorry, I was mistaken there when I spoke. Uh, you don't actually get all the Poyozo dolls in Vash's house. Uh, you get one in each person's house, if that makes sense. So now we're moving on to the 40-point uh game, I guess you could say. Uh, it's going to be the same thing that we did in order to get... Uh, Vash's clone. We're going to go ahead and do it. It starts off almost painfully slow, to be honest with you, between how often you have to put in the commands. We're, we're, we're going to be doing Kyra's here. She's the last one for me. But uh, there are really no big rewards for this. You can get a couple you know, neat items. I'll try to show off uh, d the houses when when we're all done and we can see everything that we get because everything's going to be in everybody's house. They start getting a little bit faster here at the end and this is much more my pace to be honest with you. <laughs> when I can remember 
the, the laugh and the surprise commands, because I sometimes forget those. There we go. And the clone will be at Kyra's house, and this is going to be a Kyra clone, not a Vash clone. Uh, what I've been doing to get silver points is I've been fighting Gato. You get 15 uh, points for every time you you defeat him uh, and well we can one shot him now because we're completely over leveled for him and uh, you can hold a maximum of 200 points so you know don't go there too often and I need to go back because well the next game is 80 points it's ridiculous okay let's move on to the next game which is for 80 points monsters are closing in throw your pack against them and push them back into the cage this this game is kind of tough, actually. A hostage will be slowly lowered into the flames. Awesome. To save the day, you must hit the blue light to raise the rope. Defeat all monsters before the hostage's goose is cooked. Now, this is kind of challenging. It's one of those you have to uh, constantly uh, just push things back. There we go. Let's keep pushing them. And then keep... Raisin Novin when we can. One more. Still not enough. There we go. And we have won. Well done. Take this cat. And that is your prize. You get a kitty. I do like kitties. <laughs> Hooray. But we are done with that place. Which is great because it was expensive. And now for the final mini game. Uh, I have switched to game mode 2 for this. Because this is going to be my attempt to do the perfect run of the jet bike and what do I mean by my attempt to do the perfect one I'm aiming for 1300 to be honest with you the max score is uh, 2371 points I have never gotten even close to that I've never even broken a thousand uh, but the idea here is to stay in front of him as long as possible and in fact for the perfect run you can never let him pass you as you can see I've already failed that twice um, but Oh, God. <laughs> I, 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 I've never been able to do this, and I have no anticipations that I'm ever going to be able to get a prize from this, but you can. Uh, I'll go over those once I get a chance. Uh, this is the best way I've heard in order to take care of this. Uh, at least, uh, you know, you, you can see where he is and all that kind of stuff at any given point. And then... I did win, and I broke a thousand points, so that's a new personal best for me, but like I said, the prices don't start until you get to 1300, which I've never been able to do. You get five mid-tonics uh, for, for getting 1300 points. Uh, it says mid-ethers, but they're actually mid-tonics. Uh, then you can get a power tab um, for the first time that you beat uh, 1500 points. Of course, you know, Yes, new high score. I'm very happy with that, to be honest with you. Uh, then you can also uh, get five ethers for 2,000 points, and then if you get 2,300 points, you can get a full ether. Five full ethers, I should say. But really, I I'm just not willing to, to practice that much at this one in order to get those kinds of prizes. So that is the Jet... Uh, jet race uh, you do want just jet bike race why do I have trouble saying that uh, you do want to at least beat this once um, for, for reasons I'll become apparent very soon but you can win prizes from this I've just never been able to do it <laughs> I suck at this game so much and with all the mini games out of the way we have made it back to the Proto Dome in 2300 AD and I just wanted to show off our prizes here we do have the balloon clone hanging out in Bloom's house along with the Poyoso doll and because we did the bike race and we were able to win and by that I just mean beat Johnny not get prizes the Poyoso doll plays music how awesome is that kinda nice music actually I don't recognize it from anything though oh there we go there's there's some music that I recognize but that's it for Bloom's house and in Jojo's house we do have the Jojo clone Two Jojos. Oh, how awesome is that? And she's also got a Poyozo doll. Which does play different music. How awesome is that? I love the music idea. What's up, Kino? Jojo okay, Kino okay. Levels fall, reptiles gone, good. Put it cold now, hunting bad. But Kino not give up. Jojo, don't worry, leave to Kino. <laughs> so that's Jojo's house. It's kinda nice. 
kind of nice. I do like the clone in Poyozo doll. Now if we had Luke with us, this would be where his clone in Poyozo doll would be, but unfortunately I don't have him with us because I killed him. He kind of deserved it. He kind of deserved it. This is the, the North Cape, by the way. This is where we fought him. It's in uh, 12,000 BC. I'm sure you guys remember. And here in Novin's house, we can see his clone. Oh, look at that victory pose. And his Boyozo doll. Oh, I like that music. I like that one. That one's nice. Very nice, Novin. I like your place. Your pad. Ha, ah, frog. And now it's on to Kyra's house. Now Kyra's a little different here. She has the clone over here. However, the Poyozo doll is not in that room. It's the only one that I know of that is in two different rooms. Here's the Poyozo doll. Oh, and Kyra's got the sad music, probably because she remembers Lara, her mom, who, well, is, is still hanging out over here, sitting down. <laughs> Sorry, I haven't gone back and saved her. Nor will I. Nor will I this time. And here in Lamia's room in the castle, we can see her clone as it yells at me. What did I do wrong, clone? What did I do? Oh. I, I never grabbed that mega elixir back there. I should have grabbed that. All the items are restocked in New Game Plus. I don't think I've gone over that. And then once again, another Poyozo doll with more music. Always nice. Always nice. And last but not least, we do have Vash's house. Here's his clone hanging out over here. He's surprised. And his Poyoza doll plays the sweet, kind of depressing music again. Now, there, there is a way to get cats in his place. I have 58 ounces of cat food. Uh, I did that by doing a lot of grinding, to be honest with you, just to get that. Uh, and all that's got me is one extra cat here. Now, I can't actually like talk to the kitty uh, if you get I believe 160 ounces of uh, cat food you can get up to 11 cats in your place uh, here's the other two that I've got but I have uh, well I've been grinding to get 58 ounces of cat food for about a half hour so I am not really willing to to try to get 160 ounces uh, just to show off all the different cats you can get very very many cats though cats hooray for kitties